He made me feel safe. And he was, he was my best friend. Iliana Carmona holding back tears as she talks about her husband, Steve Carmona, who was killed in a crash on I-10 in East El Paso. My husband was an amazing man. He used to say that he was uh, antisocial, but he was the life of the party. Carmona says Steve was well known by everyone. Every where he went, people knew him. People would always stop him in the streets to tell him what a great shirt he was wearing or his cap or to comment on his amazing beard. Carmona says they have been together for 22 years and married for 10. Steve leaves behind seven children and one grandchild. We are, we're a close family, all of us. Carmona says these last couple of months have been tough for her and her whole family. They have been dealing with a lot of loss, including Steve's mother who passed away about a month ago. It's been hard. We lost my grandmother in January, my mother-in-law in February, and now my husband in March. Carmona hopes that he's reunited with all of them. It brings me comfort. I hope that, I hope they were waiting for him. I hope they were there to welcome him with open arms. Carmona tells me that they are planning to lay Steve to rest within the next two weeks, and she is grateful for the outpouring support from the community. Reporting live in East El Paso, Jacqueline Quinones, KFOX 14 News at 5.